Hi, this is Neil from SurfaceProTechReviews.com and lately I've been having problems with my Surface dock and uh, I mainly use it to connect to an external monitor and lately when I plug in the um, the power plug into the into my Surface Pro um, how it used to automatically connect to my second monitor lately it hasn't and been troubleshooting it and just found out how to fix it and thought I'd share it for those of you who may be going through the same thing okay so uh, I'm just gonna jump right into it it's gonna be a short video and uh, hopefully it helps you the first thing you need to do um, open up a web browser and I'm gonna put this link in the uh, in the show description but just I'm going to kind of retrace my steps and show you what I did. And the first thing is we're going to install the Microsoft Surface Dock Updater. It's a tool straight from Microsoft. Um, so and it was this very first link that I clicked on uh, Microsoft Surface Dock Updater and in here this is the tool right for Microsoft and it's this link right here click on that if you're going through how I'm doing it and it takes you here and I will put this link as I said in the description and uh, go ahead and click on down you could look if you want to look at the details um, read through it when you're done hit download I've already downloaded this, um, so I won't go through the whole thing. But and over here, you'll notice they want you to select what all you want out of this package. The only thing you're gonna need is right here: the Surface Dock Updater Setup that MSI, 32.4 megabytes. Okay, that's all you need. Go ahead and hit next. And then you'll see if you're using Edge or whatever web browser you're using, you'll see some kind of notification that um, it's ready. Go ahead and save it and then go ahead and run it. And I'll show you how that looks like. Um, I guess because I already have it, it didn't show up. But before this, you're going to get a pop up box um, asking you, do you want do you trust this uh, publisher? And you know that's a it's a good thing to watch for. Make sure you don't download bogus things on your computer. So uh, in this case, it's right for Microsoft. Go ahead and say next, or say yes to that, and then you can go through this. Now this is asking me different questions than what I did the first time. Um, after you go through the installation of this Surface Stock Updater, um, it's going to ask you to make sure to plug in your surface dock to your surface and then uh, click on OK It's going to check for updates and if it isn't uh, running the latest firmware it's going to tell you that it's going to tell you it's going to take a while and make sure you don't disconnect uh, the power from the or the plug the dock from the surface um, and it's going to tell you if you do you may harm your uh, dock so make sure you got some I'd say probably about a good 15 20 minutes set aside to do it um, it is going to depend on how far back your computer or your dock firmware is I know I have updated it once before but uh, the way to do so has changed it used to be a lot more automatic and it just I don't know it seems to be that um, it's not that way anymore so I'm going to go ahead and cancel this because, like I said, I've already done it. And it took me, I did it the first time, it went through, uh, It and then it rechecked it again, and it said again that it's not on the latest firmware. I had to do it again. Uh, I did that about three or four times, and I noticed that it was getting stuck on that last part. It would show that um, it was at 100%, and it just kind of hung there. 
Um, so if yours happens to hang there too, let me show you what I did to fix that. Um, well, I guess I'm not going to show you. I'm going to tell you. But uh, the first thing you can try doing is closing that updater tool. And then, you know, go to your start menu and you'll see it at the top because you recently added it. Reopen it and uh, do it again. Let it go through. Wait. If it still doesn't, uh, let me close that. If it still doesn't, um, you know, finish or tell you that it's done, uh, the second thing you could do is try restarting your Surface device, whatever it is. Restart that. Reopen up that program again, uh, the Surface Updater tool, run it again. If that doesn't work, uh, then the last thing that I did was I actually unplugged the, the dock itself. I unplugged it for a... Uh, and left it unplugged for a couple minutes, let it get enough time to reset it, uh, plugged it back in, ran that uh, utility, and it said it was up to date. And that's it. So uh, if you're having any kind of technical difficulties with that dock, I know it's really useful when it works, but it's pretty aggravating when it doesn't. Uh, hopefully that helps. And uh, if you know someone else that has the dock, be sure to share the video. Otherwise, thanks for watching.